Uh, what's up, baby? Greetings, class, ladies and germs. As you guys can see in live HD, it's a thrift god, all kind of oh, back with a brand new trip to the thrift video. Now, before we get into it, some housekeeping. I just want to give my thanks and appreciation to everyone who watched my previous video, especially the people that dropped comments, such as my boy Nicholas Vivo -lo 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 -lo. He said thumbs up for that toupee being on straight the whole video. Yes, I was rocking my infamous Edgar haircut. I also hit a vocal number on the previous video. So if you guys just haven't seen it, go ahead and watch it. Also, thank you to everyone who has been shopping on the website, thriftheavenvintage.com. Shout out to homie Joseph, man. You got yourself a good one. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate all y'all. Link in description. Now, like the video before we get started. But without further ado, we're gonna hit these thrifts to find some great stuff to flip, to keep, to style, and everything in between. Let's go ahead and get in there. All right, all right. All right guys, we have arrived. Salvation Army Family Thrift Store. Y'all know what time it is. I parked in the shade. It's hot, it's humid, it's moist. And hopefully, I can dive in to the moisture. I'm not sure how you top that. And alrighty, class, we're live in the Salvation Army, man. And you guys know I come in with straight surgical precision on these half off days, and I don't play. Now, I will tell y'all, they still have the couch where you can twerk your booty up. The red velour gets spanked with a feather. It's still here, okay? So if you guys are interested in partaking in any extracurricular adult activities, they have the facility. All right? Okay. Now, this chair is a banger, so I'm gonna plot my down on this and uh, reveal some of the clothing finds that we have today because the cart is loaded all the way up. But we're gonna start with the bang because there is a straight banger that I found up in here. Check it out. My guys, look at this. Right in time, literally yesterday, Germany got eliminated from the Euro 2020. Bruh, for the low price of $7, Seven. they have the Deutsches Fussball Wund. Yes, I speak German. Hey, my granny was full German. She could speak it. Obviously, I never heard her because I'm illiterate in multiple languages, okay? I can't speak barely anything. But um, nice to have a quarter of my heritage represented on this super old school 90s Adidas Germany jersey. This could be early 2000s. I think it's very late 90s. Super clean with the multicolored stripes. And then look at that tag. Oh, it's flawless, man. Tree stripes on the back. Oh, this is an amazing piece. Now, I also found another jersey, some hometown heat. Low key, you could blend in perfectly with the couch. It's Mr. Lazy Eye himself, Tracy McGrady. Oh, an elementary school legend. Bro, Tracy McGrady had a lazy eye, right? Is that confirmed? I think it might be. And then we have a variety of t-shirts that are decent. Nothing too, too wild. 3M US Navy, but bruh, the tag, the softies choice. Oh, pre-shrunk to who dollars. I just love seeing my vintage tags in full shining glory. All right, you also have the uh, Jesus Christ Superman logo. All right, shout out soldier, big soldier. And then you have this No Boundaries, which I think was an old school like Walmart brand. Tap dance with the beer, vintage t-shirt, old school taglery. And then this is an absolute crisper. All right, nice shamrock green color scheme. Equipo Olimpico, you got the Costa Rica, vintage Olympic like polo. You got the torch. This thing is puff printed. That's super nice. And what also are nice are some little formal bangers. I love nothing more than the divine 90s design. Look at the pattern, magenta, navy, forest green, six bucks, three today. TCU horny toads, if I was a toad, you guys know, that would be the one I am, okay? You have the Ivy League Yale on the champion tag. I had to grab this because I knew it was cozy. San Antonio Spurs, it'll just feel good on nipple. Oh yeah, and the belly button lint that'll accumulate from this thing. Oh, unreal, oh, unreal. And then this little honorable mention. I think this is a ladies, but this is just a flamingo pink. Very nice. You guys know a lot of shrimp ingestion has happened. Dickies all embroidered on the shirt. Just a beautiful, subtle garment, extra large, 
350 today originally. Seven. And then last and not least, a little banger for your mother. All right. The Tommy for your mommy. Six dollar hitter. Super nice. Super clean. I love it. Shout out Salvation Army, man. Always coming through. And alrighty guys, we're up out of there. Hopefully my lens is not fogging up and it definitely is. It definitely is fogging up, dude. It's so humid. But we have a bag full of stuff, man. I wanna shout out <laughs> I wanna shout out the worker up in there. Dude, one time I took my mom, right? Hold on. So one time I brought my mom to the Salvation Army, dude. And now anytime I go in there, he's like, where's your mom? And today I was like, hey man, she she lives like in Austin. She doesn't live down here. And he's like, oh, I'm sorry. So at first I was thinking, does he think I live at home? But then the amount of times he asked, I was like, you trying to holler at my mom, bro? Are you trying to holler at Miss Cantu, my mother? Mm-mm, not here, not today. Nah, man, but he was a cool guy and I got cool finds. So I really appreciate them for always coming through with the heat. Um, let's proceed to yet another spot, dude. All right, guys. So I'm in the next spot. Family thrift outlet on Hillcroft. And look at this collegiate banger, man. You got the champion reverse weave Alabama roll tie basketball. That thing is nice. And then one time for Kinky. It's all about the what? It's all about the you. Oh my goodness gravy. I remember I lost because I stepped on the damn rope. You got the American Heart Association jump rope for heart. Evidently my sister won. I guess I'm trash in the family when it comes to jump roping, but it is what it is, man. I'm a beast at hopscotch. Anyways, you have this amazing US soccer jersey as well. Nike with the signature. My God. Jeez, the classic crew neck with the tin foil embroidery, straight metallic. Shining, sparkling, glistening. Nice. nice. Dude, the Hard Rock Cafe said, I I'm Planet Hollywood. We got silver embroidery as well. Save the planet Chicago. That's amazing. That's what I love, man. Full thrift fits, brothers. 1996 or 69 if you flip it over. <gasps> Wonderful. You can layer and slay in the beautiful denim Levi's vest atop the bike week tee. Perfect single stitch. Oh, the Chevy Nova? Dude, I used to watch Nova on PBS, man. Shout out my education. Oh my gosh, guys, look at the custom. I think this is customized. You got the Mrs. Potato Head crew neck, and then you have the not Mr. Potato Head. What the heck? It's just potato. No head. Damn. All right, guys, so I found a t-shirt in the first store. You have the Ivy League Yale on the champion tag. Now you have the crew neck, so you can go all Ivy League in this thing. Yale all the way out. This is Butamus. I don't know if this guy got in a tragic accident. You'll shoot your eye out, kid. Looks like the BB gun took a toll on this man's face. Uh-oh. First the Yale, now this. Dude, some intercollegiate rivalries happening, dude. Ivy Leagues only. Beautiful AKA colorway with the pink and the green, the Harvard on the maroon. This is a super nice piece. And I could throw on some ice creams and match perfectly. 1991. Dude, sometimes subtlety is key. And look at these subtle pieces. They need a closer inspection, okay? Look at this. You got the I hate a goofy especially. A goofy especially. Too goofy. Disney Hawaiian shirt with characters all over it. Pluto, Mickey. Big goof in the swim trunks. All right, super cool, classic. And then check out this piece, right? Subtle, you got the little Ralph Lauren sport, but what is that? Yes, that is a skiing bear. Complete with the sweater, with a reindeer on it, the scarf, and the beanie. Polo sport by Ralphius Lorenis. Size small, YKK zips. Dude, this thing is actually nuts. So subtle, so clean. Ah, I'm excited. And then look at this right here, daddy. Not gonna knock this fat flatty. Oh, I read that wrong. Stupid. Not gonna knock this cat flat. Look at that. I don't know what the heck this is for, but it appears to be a rollerblading cougar. I'm not mad at it. Good Lord, guys. You got the lighthouse landing tee, the raw bar. Uh-oh. You know there's a lot of reproducing happening there, guys. Disgusting, but amazing. I feel like I did not show up for this, man. 
Look at this, that, that little dog right there with his tongue hanging out. But then it got the dog booty. Said, enjoy the view. The disrespect, the forced bestiality of this garment is unreal. Unreal. Why and how? Who would disrespect a Tigger crew neck like this? It looks like Tigger took a bite out of their neck. No. And you got the Ohio State Buckeyes. Oh, hit them with it, Dreezy. I see all this money through my Ohio State Buckeyes. Outstanding. Oh my goodness. Soft, sophisticated, and sexy. Yes, sir. I don't know if I should agree with this t-shirt though. The forced bestiality of this garment is unreal. Unreal. Oh my God, this is my worst fear realized, dude. An alligator on a golf cart. Not like this, dude. Harley Davidson at the village, only in Florida. And it's high rotted out, man. I want that golf cart, honestly. And a gator that can, that can golf? Bruh, it's like a golden goose. Ho oh, boring on the front. All right, guys, this is wild, dude. In the sneaker section, just chilling right next to some bootleg moccasins you have the neon nike foam posits just glowing looking like radioactive afterbirth <laughs> hold up these things are nuts man retail is 230 right now on these bad dudes but uh yeah you could go to the construction site just rocking some nikes not even worry about getting ran over any accidents happening these are perfect real carbon fiber they're actually heavily distressed i don't know what's going on but um let's check the size Ooh! all right hold on man let's have my cinderella moment right now you know these are heavily worn in but you know what i could clean them i could cut the grass in these do i need more shoes definitely not hold on dude oh if the boot fits I think these are actually like half a size too small. I think they're 11 and a half or size 11. Um, very uncomfortable in the toe, but it is what it will be. Got some phone posits in the thrift. Sway. Oh, you got a three for, shout out David Mann. Ooh, ride the lightning? Let's go, a very cool t-shirt right here. Easy Rider St. Louis. And then um, I don't even put oil in my car, but you got the Castrol GTX. I just wait till it over. He's gonna get a new one, baby. America. Look at this thing, man. In the lab, this is a super cool shirt. Holy hell, dude. That's like when you put, what are those little things called? Like a Mento and a two liter? Just take off, man. That, my friends, is aeronautics. Uh, then you also got the Super Bowl T, the Champions 2000 New Millennium. Greatest show on turf. Double X. Oh guys, look at this piece right here, man. This thing is so thick. Got the Adidas with the three stripes. No, but seriously, look at that. How many track jackets have the big trifoil logo right there on the spinal column? Not many, I tell you. And then you got the Phoenix Suns. Oh yes, Amari Studemeyer jersey. Wow, the hanger's really not participating in this video. Oh my goodness. You know what? I quit. Another one. Another. Wow. Too icy, icier than a hockey field. Look at this, man. Coho, NHL St. Louis Blues jersey right there. Man, this thing is absolutely crispy. All embroidered. You got Mr. Jackman on the back. I don't watch hockey, I know nothing about it. I don't know who this guy is, but I assume he's good. Oh, and I assume I'm good now too, baby. We're back, man. Hello. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy today's vid, man. If you guys did, again, hit that like button. I'm trying to revive my channel and pump life back into it. So you guys clicking the like button helps me out. And also, if you want anything you guys saw in today's video, the link to my website is down below. I'm adding new pieces pretty much every day, okay? But I figured I'll conclude this video in style with something that was sent to my P.O. box from one of you guys because this is a lot easier than me saving up packages and doing an unboxing, which you guys don't even really watch. So why in the hell would I do that when I can just throw in some bonus footage at the end of this here video, all right? So I'm just gonna get Trish. We're gonna crack in and see what this little parcel that came to my P.O. box is, all right? So let's get it in. All right, so we have a note in here and it says, Ahem. To the hostess with the mostest, just some pickups that I know you'd appreciate way more than I would. Let me know if they're any good. Enjoy. 
This doesn't even have a name signed on it. What is your name, brother? Matthew Ardinte. I appreciate you, bro. Let's see what these finds are that I'll appreciate. Oh, the homie done threw me some VHSs. Yes, I've been saying it for a million times. I want to involve old VHS footage in my current videos, which I might get started with tonight, man. I'm gonna get serial with making these edits. Look at this, man. Zoom in, you got the sports blooper awards, fire. Chris Berman is the host. Look at this, man, hold on. Oh, look at that face, father. And then you got the Little League Baseball, how to hit and run. This also can be applied to um, working the steering wheel and getting in automobile accidents. And then the classic right in time, the Space Jam VHS. Thank you, Matthew. I really appreciate that. And I appreciate all you guys who watch the vids and leave comments and just interact, man. We a community, okay? And I'm glad that you guys came through to take part in today's video. Again, live the dream, eat that ice cream. It's great for our climate to not be buying new clothes all the time. So yeah, hit the thrifts, reuse, recycle, and do all that stuff, man. Earth is our planet. Earth is my planet. If you guys want to follow my Plant 2 gardening channel, link in video description, link to my website in description, and my PO in description, everything you need in descriptions. All right, I love y'all. Until next time, see ya. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life, I roost them. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to.